All right, everyone. So welcome back. It's uh, it's another day of trash picking. We're going out treasure hunting. It's just after the flea market. Uh, kind of some uh, crazy things going on. I did go out trash picking yesterday, which would have been two videos ago. I uh, did have a, uh, what was it called? Yard sale, community yard sale. So I went out afterwards expecting to find a bunch. And well, this is all I found. Okay, everyone. Welcome back. I'm getting my chest mount on. Please don't tell me there's anything in here. I like how they say it works, but i never seen a grill in this worst of a shape. So yes, it is this grill that you guys see right here. That's the only thing I found in the trash. So uh, we're going out for another trash picking episode. Uh, and we're going to hopefully find some treasure out there. I think today is the day where the local college is graduating and they are all moving out. I think that's happening either tonight or tomorrow morning. So maybe it'll throw away a bunch of garbage and we'll see how it goes and make it a fun day. Let's get into it. Let's find some treasure. Let's do it. All right. So I haven't got over to the college side of town yet. Um, we'll get there shortly. Pants are falling down, that's not good. But I did see a handful of U-Haul uh, trucks. So, that reiterates what I was thinking. Which is that they are moving out today. Just, it's amazing. The U-Haul trucks are just, they're they are lined up. And I, I guess U-Haul probably does pretty good business right now. Everyone's moving out of school. We need a large box. Great place to find it's in the trash. If we got over, it's kind of hard to determine like what people might be put at the curb to like put in their truck. So I kind of feel awkward just like stopping and grabbing stuff. Uh, I hope you stop. Thank you. Take a left over here. Oh, she see everyone. See everyone's going home. I don't think that's all going to fit, bud. be kind of depressing it, it's kind of sad to me it's not as crazy as it's been I don't know uh, well it's about when I usually come here um, sometimes there's like cars double park both ways on the move out day but uh, a little depressing to me look how much stuff they got over here look at all this garbage uh, kind of depressing to me because this is the sixth year I've come to this town on trash picking, or should I say, college move out day. The sixth year. So that means all these students, if my math is correct, when I first started doing this, were sophomores in high school. And now they're graduating college. That is just remarkable. Makes you feel old. Delta Gamma. I think that's what that is. I think it's a sorority house. Oh. Uh, oh, everything's free. I read that correctly, right? Yeah. Free. Yeah, 
there. So I think this is might be the only sorority house. I know that college really isn't known for their Greek life, their party life. It's more of a, a school known for its smarts. Kind of contraption we have out here. Oh, kids picnic table. Oh, that wasn't that exciting. Aha, we've done it again. Don't tell me it's that time of the year also, because it's getting pretty close that it might be that time of the year. It also looks exactly like the one I picked up earlier. Well, yesterday, but it was, I guess, in this video. Oh, keep those on. I gotta say, I absolutely love when people do this. They put signs on it. Please do that if you're trying to get rid of something large like this. However, if I see a grill at the side of the road, I'm not gonna assume that's yours for the keeping. Holy smokes, what are the odds? Um, hmm. Let's go through the back door over here. that over there and that'll probably break so that'd be great to listen to. I do have to donate it. Let's move this some more. Let's move it. Oh man this thing's kind of heavy with one hand. Well if I didn't break it early I broke it now. So for people who might be new and they're wondering why, just open the hood of this. I've always said, jokingly, it's not for cheeseburgers. It's to assure there's no garbage or a house nest or any other creature. I also open up the bottom drawer, which I could just turn it around to make sure there's no propane tank because the scrapyard charges you for propane tanks. I got a little bruise on my hip right now. I clipped myself somehow there. I think with the wheels, it pinched me. Got a pretty nice bruise going. Didn't take long. Now we played a guessing game. Is that snowblower out for trash? What's it doing out there? No one knows. No sign. Nothing. It's trash, free, scrap. Maybe it just got repaired and they dropped the back off at the house. Oh, I almost missed this. Don't want to miss this. I mean, it has copper like tubing on the end, but I think that's mostly all aluminum. I don't think it's the mixed copper aluminum. Kind of hard to find. I don't really see them that often. So I've seen the auto radiators from last week that were a brass and copper combination. And now this looks like it's all aluminum. All right, so I made it back. Uh, this is what we grabbed. I did pick up that boat earlier, not an actual like boat boat, not a cruise ship or a rowboat, um, but that boat that was kind of like a decoration boat, uh, decorative. I found that in the trash in that kind of like a free pile 
It's amazing how, how many houses are up for sale. I mean, I've been doing this kind of title about houses being up for sale. For some reason, those videos seem to do well, so I guess I'll just keep on going with that kind of title or that kind of basis. But in reality is, why are so many houses all of a sudden going up for sale? Another crazy thing about it is, like, I'm not, like, in real estate or anything, but it's it just amazing how these houses also stay up for sale. You know, we're looking at a couple of years now, two years or so, everything was just flying off the shelf. I mean, literally, like, you'd put up a house for sale and it'd be sold in a matter of a month, a matter of a week. Now it's, like, three months, four months. It's been up there for six months. The whole street is up for sale. So that's kind of interesting. Uh, but, yeah, they've thrown away a bunch of stuff in the past. Uh, also, side note, I guess colleges... It's that time of the year now. It's almost summer. I guess it's time for summer break, but kind of sad in a way. Uh, just going through that town again for trash picking. This was the sixth year I've been in that town for trash pickup on garbage, or I should say on college move-out day. So uh, I wouldn't say it's depressing, but it's kind of sad in a way uh, how quick time does fly. I've been doing this now for six years. Um and still, you know, posting videos constantly, still doing a thing, still enjoying this. I don't feel burnt out or stressed or anything like that. But it's just amazing how much, you know, time just flies. Six years is just, it's the same amount of time. If you guys have been following me for six years, you've probably seen more gray hair, more stress, more videos than most people have ever seen. But it's been fun. I'm going to get inside. My allergies are getting kind of bad. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys enjoyed it, as always, hit the like button. I truly appreciate it. And uh, subscribe down below for more treasure hunts. We'll be playing more. Until next time, have a great day. Keep on the dream. Peace. <laughs>